I'm here to talk about the OxyTherm cutting system. It's a great tool for metal removal that uh, Lawson Products has in their welding line. The OxyTherm cutting system is a very unique torch or gun, whatever you want to call it, but it's it, it, very simple and it's easy to use. If you look at the top, that's a tightening nut, an adjustment screw. It, it holds in the rod. Let's take it off and see what's inside here. Inside, you're going to need and find a collet. This is a 3 8 collet, which handles this 3 8 size rod. We also have a quarter inch collet, so if you move to the quarter inch size, you're going to change collets. And it, it's got a great protective shield on it. It's stainless steel. It's going to hold up well. If sparks come back at the gun, it's going to protect your hand. If you flip it over here, you're going to see the adjustment handle. There's only one speed all the way on. You adjust the flow on your flow meter on your oxygen tank. But what's another unique feature is you can pop the red cap here and it'll, it'll lock it out so you can't turn it on. It's a safety feature. All right, so that's the gun. Now let's go ahead and load it. So I, I'm, I see I have a 3 8 inch rod here. I need a 3 8 inch collar. I'll put on the tightening nut just a little bit. And the beauty of it is you can load it fast. You're just going to put the rod in at the top, push it until it stops, and tighten the screw down. Very simple. When you tighten it, that rod will not come out. So imagine how quickly you can change rods. You burn one down and pull it out quick, put another one in, and tighten it in. Quick and, and easy. If you notice coming out of it, this is an oxygen hose. Uh, and, and the oxygen hose obviously connects to the oxygen, and you must have a gauge on that tank. If you look over here, let's talk about how to get it started. You need 12 volts, that's it. So th think of the versatility. You could be on a portable welding truck, and all you do is hook it to the battery. Uh, you can, uh, if you don't have a battery, but you have a welder there, you can actually cr start the welder up and turn it all the way down to 20 amps and hook it to the leads and start it that way. Uh, here's a great, way to, great thing to use. It's this portable battery unit. You can be out in the middle of nowhere with that and, and still start it up. Uh, let's talk about the, uh, the rods for a minute. The Chronotron line under Lawson has some unique products here. Uh, this particular one is the 3H. It's probably the most popular. It comes in two foot lengths and three foot lengths. What's unique about it is it's flared and it'll stack and it'll work in longer lengths. So with a three foot rod, you can stack three of them up and be nine feet away from your work, which helps protect you from the sparks. It's a great, you can reach up high into an area from, from a low area and go ahead and cut with it. So that's a great advantage. On the three, uh, on the uh, quarter inch, the smaller size, unique thing about that is you can bend it and, and you'll still get the flow of oxygen through it. So that means you can stand back to the side and get out of the way with it. So that, these are unique products. Now, on the positive side, that's going to hook up and actually run right over to the torch. So now I've completed the cycle. So once the rod is in, it comes with a striker plate and you scratch it like a match and you'll see sparks while holding down the oxygen, it'll start right up. Go. Here's a tip for blowing out pins to keep straight in the pin. 
so you're not cutting the side of the pin or into the boss of the material hole in the pin. Take a piece of flat iron, tack it to the pin, and take a 3 8 inch pipe, tack it to that plate so then you can use it as a guide to go center it with the rod right in the middle of the pin and you're always centering it.